I want to bring in Michael Mukasey right now. He is former attorney general for George W. Bush and former federal judge. And it is great to see a judge. Thanks so Good much for be being with here. You. Uh, your remark, your, your reaction to what you just heard from David Cicilline. Uh, hard to know where to begin. The notion that there was no FISA abuse is ridiculous. The FISA court um, was not told the reason why Steele was no longer an FBI informant, which is not only that he spoke to the press, but that he lied about it. There's a, di there's a big difference exactly. in his credibility. Yeah. Yeah. Secondly, Carter Page, who was the subject of the FISA warrant, they had to show that probable cause to believe that not only that he was an agent of a foreign power, but that he was involved in the commission of a crime. The one person in all of this who has not been charged with a crime is Carter Page. <laughs> After, after two years, right. and you've got the Constitution right in front and of you. So his, his, the, notion, the, the notion, yeah, the notion that there is a that there is a, a constitutional duty of oversight is hogwash. Yeah, um, this is a Constitution. The word oversight isn't anywhere in it. Let me switch gears and ask you about this legal spat over naming Matthew Whitaker as as the acting Attorney General. Your thoughts on this? Does the president need to get a Senate confirmed uh, AG in there as soon as possible, or what? What, what are your thoughts on Matthew Whitaker? Um, I don't know Matthew Whitaker. Um, I, I know people who think highly of him, but that doesn't necessarily mean that he can fill this position. Um, the, um, there is a statutory authorization to name somebody who has the qualifications Matt Whitaker has. He's been there for 90 days in a senior role. The, under the, under the, under the uh, Vacancies Act, he can be appointed. However, the Constitution says that the president can appoint um, officials, which is defined by Supreme Court cases as principal officers, um, only with the advice and consent of the Senate. Matt Whitaker is not was not in a position that was confirmed by the Senate. There are people who were. Right. Um, not only Rosenstein, who's got conflict issues relating to uh, the Mueller investigation. Well, he signed off on the last FISA warrant. Yeah, let's, but, let's not forget that. Right. Um, but Noel Francisco, who is the Solicitor General, could be put in as as acting, um, and he would be qualified. We're gonna we're gonna keep following this because this this is uh, going to be real critical, particularly as the Dems are trying to investigate the president. Will Will they be able to get his tax returns and create and, and perhaps impeach, impeach the president based on what they have? Look, um, impeachment is a political act, and if they have a majority, conceivably, they could pass an article of impeachment. Uh, obviously, they need two-thirds of the Senate to convict, and that's not happening. Uh, whether they're going to do that or not, I have no idea. Um, in order to get his tax returns, they'd have to show that it relates to a subject that they are legitimately investigating. If they can, they'll get them. All right, we will leave it there. Michael Mukasey, it was a pleasure.